follow us on social media, and don't forget to subscribe. Oh yeah, it's the 4K rock star himself. You already know who it is. So come over and check out my thoughts. All right, I guess Brass is doing his thing right now. I'm in Ghost in the Shell. Let's keep perfecting. Oh, that's right. Yeah, we can't forget about the 3D version. This film has the same tech specs as the 4K, so it wasn't shot natively in 3D, but was a post-conversion. All I can say is wow. Yeah, you don't get that fine minutia of detail. Yeah, the image isn't super bright, but the entire world opens up way better in depth than the 4K version can give you. The glass break scene was excellent in 4K, but in 3D, you get glass coming out of the screen barrier, and in the middle, you have Scarlet, and then you have the background elements. The shattered glass mixed with the Atmos soundtrack brings a better sense of realism as to what's happening on screen. There's also the part where a major does the deep dive into the geisha. She's in the center of the screen as the surroundings are passing her by. It gives you the feeling you're falling straight into the screen with her. There were a bunch of other scenes where they're digitally taking you through buildings. You'll see a resemblance here to the Matrix. It's very VR looking and very dimensional. The flyover shots as you're going through the city may give you a bit of vertigo as you're going between buildings and neon signs. The colors did pop a bit more in 4K in these scenes, but 3D was way more realistic feeling. It kind of gives you the feeling that you're flying in a helicopter. Only drawback was that the really dark scenes, like the spider tank battle, did lose some of its depth. The blacks tended to blend together a bit, and it did flatten the image a little. But overall, detail was really good. Shadow detail was decent, but not as defined as in 4K. Depth was top notch. I didn't get the cardboard cutout look. And the brighter scenes were demo material. So for 3D, I'd have to give it a nine. I think if you're gonna watch it, this is the only way to go. Now, if you like and wanna support the channel so we can bring bigger and better content, visit us on Patreon. The link is below in the description. Follow us on social media and subscribe. And we'll see you guys again in the next video.